Alrighty, so um, welcome to Modern Josephus Games. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and play Empire Total War. And what I want to do is play this Road to Independence. And it's all about uh, U.S. history. So um, today we'll just play a little bit of it, about maybe a half an hour, and see where we're at from there. Um, so let's go ahead. First we have Episode 1, the Jamestown Colony. In April 1607, three Virginia company ships sailed into Chesapeake Bay under the command of Captain Christopher Newport. They made landfall on the southernmost peninsula in the bay, naming it Cape Henry in honor of the Prince of Wales. Life for the early settlers was far from easy, even though they ruled themselves. Newport returned to England for supplies to meet Captain John Smith and acquainted Newton near in charge. With limited food supplies, the constant presence of disease and the danger of attack by the native tribes, many of the settlers perished within a few months of reaching the new world. If this new community is to flourish, they will need food in the shape of farms and fisheries. A cash crop like tobacco will prove the financial viability of the colony to those back home in England and much needed income for the settlers. Complacency, however, is dangerous and the native tribes remain a threat. Let me go ahead though and bring down the volume because I feel like it is very high. There we go. Man, what a difference. I mean, it's like, boom. All right, here we go. So, doo -doo -doo, single player, road to independence. All right, let's start. Now, <laughs> so of course you have the Disney Pocahontas. And, uh, you know, you can kind of forgive them because it's Disney. Come on, it's a cartoon trying to romanticize everything. And so they make this romantic relationship between Captain Smith and uh, Pocahontas. Uh, let's go ahead and watch this. Our war on British tyranny begins tonight. All right. Well, just in case of uh, we, just in case we have issues here, it's better we not <laughs> watch anything that may prove to have copyright issues. Anyway, what I was saying is that um, uh, let's put these guys here. I feel like that's where they're gonna come. Well, you never know. These guys made rallies, so better put them here. Anyway, I was saying that, uh, uh, so that was bad enough for Disney. But there was another show called, are these guys rallying? Another show on Pocahontas. And that also was just kind of, come on, get them, guys. Get them, what are you doing? All right, that was that one. Um, I forget what was it called, The New World or something like that. That one was pretty bad too. They it only had a. Uh, they tried to do that romance between John Smith and Pocahontas, and it's just ridiculous. I, I don't. I never did really care for that. Never cared for that. She was only like 14, and he was in his mid 30s. Or something crazy like that, so it's kind of ridiculous. Anyway, all right, get ready over here because they're coming. All right, so I don't even, I'm sure that they try to make it as accurate as possible. It's just these guys sometimes they kind of look like pirates, and all they have is swords. No wonder. All I have is a sword. These guys have a rifle. I guess I should have kept them back here. So that then they can shoot? I don't know. Anyway. I'll do that. Well, apparently the sword stuff is helping, even though, you know... Swords versus tomahawks. That's what we got going here. Swords versus tomahawks. Unless these guys take out their swords once these, once the Native Americans get closer to the Iroquois, I think they are. Or no, this, no, this, this is how Hatton and his tribe, so that is. Alright, get these guys. 
There we go. Nice, nice. Okay, we won. So that one was an easy victory. All right, so we lost 21. They lost 95. All right. So, none can love freedom heartily but good men. All right, Jamestown 1607. From the very beginning. All right, we'll skip that. I don't know what copyright things I have, so we better we better not do anything. Okay, mission issued. All right. Oh, come on. Really? All right, a mission has been issued. So, peasant farms. I guess that's just updating this. Protection of the Jamestown settlement and the survival of its people. Build a farm in the designated area to the west of Jamestown. The colonists will be able to produce their own food. Most people don't like this game. Um, but for me, I, I just... Okay, be quiet, lady. All right. Um, I actually like this the best. I'm just more of a guns and shooting and things like that to, um i just like that you know and it has the united states in it so you know maybe i'm biased or whatever <laughs> but i like it let's go ahead and okay what do we have here we have matchlock and these guys okay so these guys just fire what do we have right now we have okay we have one of each what does this have Arc buses. Oh, so that's John Smith. Okay, there we go. All right, what do I want? So, well, we'll get we'll get one of those. All right. All right. Let's get to the next. Let's get to the next uh, part here. So the basis of all agriculture is the humble peasant laboring in the field to bring in his master's crops or to keep his master's animals alive. Day-to-day -day life for a peasant farmer has barely changed in a thousand years. It is a short, hard life of abject poverty and back-breaking labor. He can expect nothing better than to work and die in the same village, tilling the same fields, his life bounded by the same horizon. Peasant farms are not terribly efficient. The landowners have little interest in anything beyond their rents and tithes. The problem for them is that peasant e economies are, by their very nature, cash poor and most income is in kind. And there is a limit to where, where you can spend a goat. Historically, life for a peasant was pretty much the same all over the world, work from dawn to do dusk. In Russia, the peasants were serfs, tied to the land and the property of the landowner as much as any cow or goat. In India, peasants were a caste, locked into their social position by hallowed cu custom. The system eventually broke down in Western Europe thanks to industrialization, needing a constant supply of workers and changes in usual and land usage. All right. And the reason why they throw in Russia and India is if you play this game, you can also play one of those two. All right. Congratulations. You have successfully completed this mission and have reaped the well-deserved rewards. May your inspired leadership endure and may you enjoy further success as you lead your people to greatness. We got $500 in our treasury, a new port. Okay. So we're going to have to, I bet that's the next mission, a fishery. So they want us to build a fishery. All right, let's build this fishery. Oh, that's our only option. Well, thank you. In the meantime, yes, we'll recruit. Let's go ahead and bring this guy in here to the fort. And we'll recruit this, on this guy. There is often a and... of building types to construct okay. a resource slot. You can only follow one of these 15 barrels of tobacco Once you have constructed the base or 15 barrels of cotton will only be available from the same I don't think there's any difference well we'll we'll just do the traditional 15 barrels of tobacco because that's what how they started this colony it was all built on tobacco so that's what we're gonna go for all right new units have been recruited there we go new unit nice. They didn't send us another one. I guess we gotta get just this fishery. So let's get this fishery going. All right. You have successfully built a peasant farm and local fishery in the Jamestown region. Jamestown. All right. So we have to capture them. 
Now they didn't say anything about how they declared war on us. We just have to go capture it. <laughs> Difficult. All right, let's go. Let's go capture them then. Winning a battle isn't just about great All right, normally in a battle, in these types of battles, I'm just like, ah, forget it. Let's just win. So we have 510 to 510. I could have gotten another, I guess, one of these guys. The uh, 5th Regiment of Militia. Or a regiment. What, what are these? Oh, okay. So, um, I forget what are these guys called. Uh, man. Well, I could have gotten these guys anyway and had more overpowering numbers. But okay, we're going to have to do with what we have. Alright, so. Um... Let's go ahead and assault, and we'll have a little battle here. When a man is able to abuse with a smile, he is worthy to become a leader. Don't know that guy. Alright. Man, normally what I love doing is getting these guys on top of a hill, because then you are firing down on them. So if I bring this regiment up here, that way they have an uphill battle, unless I have to attack. I may have to attack, they may not attack me. But we'll just check and see. Let's bring these guys up here on this mountain. All right. All right, let's end deployment and let's see what we have to do. Are they going to come to me, or do I have to go to them? They might not come to me. Let's just check this out. Okay, so it looks like they're going to wait for me. Are they all arrow dudes? Oh no, these are like villagers. Oh my word. Spearmen. Okay, so we have spearmen. Well, I thought they had archers. Gotta have archers somewhere. Where's the archers? Oh, here's their archer. Oh, somebody's coming. Who are the? Oh, these are their archers. Okay. So, bring these guys here along this ridge. Double quick. Is there any other Native Americans coming? All right, so let's bring these guys here, and you guys can start firing, man. Maintaining a unit's courage and regimental oh, no. discipline in the Halt. heat of battle is Halt. dependent on their Just morale. Just stay up here. A measure of pride and self-belief in their abilities. This is boosted All right. by experience and the presence of an inspirational general. Morale is weakest when heavily outnumbered or run. There we go. Fire. The bottom right of the screen there you go. Shoot him. Toggle the selected units between running or walking. Running is useful for going somewhere in a hurry, but doing it too much. I just like how we didn't even declare a war. We just kind of went and took them. I mean, <laughs> oh my. Okay. Anyway, it's just like you are just naturally in a state of war. Oh, okay. Thank you. Let's bring these guys here. As we all know, um, Pocahontas tried to avoid war. Dude, what is wrong with these militiamen? You can't just... Okay, whatever. Yeah, I'm very confident that if they attacked me, I mean, just this, these guys could would take care of business all by themselves. So... There we go. As long as we don't wear and killing women and children, you know? Okay, here, come, here they come with their arrows. Are these guys attacking yet? No, they're not. Okay. Oh, let's move these guys forward. There we go. And we'll leave these two regiments to kind of just do this shooting type thing at them. Yeah, there we go. Alright, in the 
meantime, these three regiments will go ahead and move in. Let's double click, that way they get moving. Okay, get in line. Alright, let's move forward a little bit to get a good shot in. There we go. Alright. There, yeah. So they're gonna just get destroyed. I mean, basically it's a whole bunch of guys with pitchforks who are fighting. Not even competition. Okay, they're gonna try to flank. Halt. How are these guys faring? Okay, so just trading pot shots there. Alright. Come on, guys. Fire. What are we doing? My word. Fire. Double quick. Double quick, double quick. Get in there, man. Holy cow. Alright, so let's look at these guys. So, they had match locks. These guys look like, it looks like I have a whole bunch of Indiana Jones. <laughs> Just like, Indiana Jones and Indiana Jones. Alright, see, what, where, where's these guys? Are, are they just these guys up here? Do they look different? Okay, okay, so these guys look more like what probably would have arrived in the New World. Uh, with these little hats, these other Indiana Jones guys, they look like Indiana Jones, okay? We're going out exploring or something. Oh man. Okay, so we routed them. Oh. Go ahead and shoot these guys here. Alright. Just in case. Okay, you guys can fire. All right, Indiana Jones. So basically a route. I don't know if I have to even go into the town. Well, these guys have to route first. So. Come on, turn around, shoot them. Whatever you guys are doing, it ain't working, but have fun. Okay, so those guys aren't that scattered, but for now we don't have to worry about them because they're running. Okay. Okay, so they're running now too. Alright, we will defend this hull. Fire, lads! Fire! Fire, yeah. Alright. How many more soldiers? Okay, 113. I only have 69 there. Dude, you guys take forever to shoot. My word. Okay. Anyway. Shoot these guys. 55 out of 75. Alright. Okay, so they have less than 100. 
Man, who just sits there just to get shot at? Okay. Flank them! Flank them, yeah, they're already stumbling all over the place. Oh man, they've lost a lot of men. Powhatan's warriors. A flashing unit banner means the morale of their troops is wavering. Yeah. Before long, they'll break from combat and rout from the field. Take this opportunity to charge their ranks with cavalry or infantry okay. with bayonets fixed. Yeah, I don't have any of that. So. Okay, so they have 66, I have 74. Wow, these guys didn't lose. They're just losing their first man. Alright, so get in there. Do your little thing. Shoot. Yeah, these guys, man, they're down to 45. And these guys only lost one troop. These guys lost four. These guys, oh man, these guys really got, oh, they got destroyed. Those arrows, it must have been those arrows. The arrows did it. These guys only lost one man. Just halt. Halt right there. They're running. They're not coming back. Alright. So yeah, so all we have is this battle here. And we got these guys who haven't routed yet. So we just have to take care of that. I never saw... Oh yeah, I think there's a warpath where you can play the Native Americans. The Iroquois, but I've never played them before. Okay. I, I just went out. Just so far away, it's not even. Okay. Halt. Just come and attack here. That's all you have to do. Okay. Forward in. There we go. Are they forever routed? They got 60 men left. Do I actually have to capture the village? Walk into it? I don't think so. Yep, and battle. Alright, so victory. We won! What? Men dodging this way from a fight? Okay. Along with a breakdown of the conditions. So we lost 77 men. They lost. Oh, they lost 510. Okay. I don't. I didn't see that, but I guess so. So we won that. Okay. Oh, you have successfully captured the village of Wera Wakamoko and are well on the way to reducing the threat to Jamestown. So next is Shaka Maxon. Shaka Maxon in Pennsylvania. Wow. Okay, we're really we are really moving all over this place, aren't we? So Maryland is ours. Your region capital is the city We'll rebuild this. Empire Total War differs from previous Total War Let's by having buildings spread throughout the Get these men up to full. There are slightly different buildings available for construction in the region capital than in towns. Troops can be stationed inside a city to provide defense in the event. You will do. They also act as a deterrent for any. We will do these guys here. No, 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 no. There are only, what, 75? How many men do we have here? Um, 75, 120. We'll get 120 for reinforcements. All right, let's get to the next. And these guys will meet up with them. That should be enough to take care of. Shakamax in Pennsylvania. I don't remember John Smith coming way up here, but you know, it's nice. It's nice to think of. All right, it's nice to think of. Okay, let's get to the next. As population growth is slow here, it is recommended that you upgrade farms or bring lower class taxes down. Can I upgrade? The construction of a ports do not just colonial plantations. Provide trade yeah. goods for shipping back to your home region. Okay. The quantity of which is dependent on the type of plantation and its building level. Yeah. 
I mean, really, all we have to do is get up to there, so. Tea, cotton, coffee, and sugar can all be grown from plant. A very large army or navy spread over two or more units. 630, okay, we got this. We got this. And as long as they're attacking me, I'm good. I'm good with that. Alright, so what do we got here? Oh, we're just starting? Oh wow, okay. So, let's, um... I'm sorry, but I'm very particular about my straight lines. <laughs> like my, I like my straight lines. Alright, so we got this regiment. Real quick. Let's get these guys. We'll, we'll put these guys here. Real quick. That way we don't have it all bunched up. Do we have Native Americans coming this way at all? I don't think so. But we'll do this. Quick. Who's here? Okay, so they're coming. Alright, and then last but not least, we will block any escape they may have over here. Alright. So we're ready to give it to them. 120, that's what I want. I want the, I want at least both sides to have 120 and these 75 dudes just in the middle here. Okay, so we are ready. Okay, finally got close. What do we have here? I did not know that the Pow Hat and Confederacy spread all the way to Pennsylvania. That's a new one. All right, that's a new one. Okay. You guys just shoot them, all right? That way we take care of that. I have these guys here, I don't mind. They might come back, so we'll just keep an eye there. Okay, they're trying to do that, so refuse the line. Right there. That way they don't do that. I don't know if those guys will come back. Uh, we'll just leave you guys there. Just in case. A little bit closer, add your weight to this. Go. Range on these guns was terrible. Terrible. One twenty seven. Okay. Just go after them. Go after them. That's what they want. Okay. In the meantime, I knew I needed to do this. There we go. So we got them. We got them. They're running. These guys are dropping men. Let's kind of do this number. A 
184, 109, they're gonna lose me, but it's okay. In battle, okay, that was a that was a pretty easy victory there. Every post is honorable. Man, I can't even read these anymore. I used to have a slower computer, and so I would spend like five minutes looking at that screen. All right, so we don't have to deal with that anymore. That's nice. All right, I think what I'm going to do... Oh, man, they got a lot of men in there. I'm not even going to... Um... I'm just going to auto-resolve this because I know it's going to be an easy victory. Yeah, I'm only going against 45 dudes, so that's not anything that I need to worry about. Um, I can recruit, so that's good. Replenish my lost boys. Okay. Alright, so... Do I want to recruit some more men? We will, just in case. We'll see what that looks like. All right. You know, recruited. Let's see what happens here. Oh man. Oh man, they got a lot of men there. All right, I'm going to lay siege there, and I'm going to try to bring in some reinforcements. We'll recruit. We'll bring these guys as close as I can as reinforcements. I'll probably be attacked in this next one, so these guys won't get there before that happens. All right. Well, we'll leave it here. And uh, we'll do this another time. So let me go ahead and save it here. Okay. So thanks for watching. And we'll see you in the next video. Remember, like, share, comment, subscribe. And we'll see you all later.